Hey everyone, today I am going to do my August haul. I already filmed most of my cold items. I have two more cold items left, but I decided to do this in two hauls because I had a lot of items from Kohl's and that should be up before this video. Um, I'm hoping to edit it today. So, um, first I have a lot of bralettes. I'm just going to show you guys those first. Four of them are from Target and one is from Forever 21. This first one from Forever 21, I already purchased this already in like a rust orange color and I saw this one online and they had free shipping one day. I don't remember what day it was, but yeah, I got this uh, in a medium and this does fit um if you're a little bit bigger chested i do wear 3040 and this one does fit me in a medium uh some of theirs actually usually i need a large bralette but this one ended up being good in the medium so also when they're not adjustable in the back i like to get the smaller size usually at target i actually ended up getting a large so and i have ones that aren't adjustable i got a large but anyway this was like 12 90 I don't have it on my list for some reason. I think these are $12.99 each. I already bought this with the like racer back that's not really adjustable. But I got this white one. Just with the strap that has like a regular bra clasp. And this one was $12.99. And these are by exhilaration. I got them all in a large. First one was Forever 21. I also got the peach color. They look cute. And I love bralettes. One, because it's hot as hell outside. The humidity level here is ridiculous. I just had to turn my air off so you guys can uh, hear me. Um, and I'm using artificial lighting. Hopefully it looks okay. I can't quite tell. But uh, it's been raining every single day. I've been trying to film and I'm like, oh. I already filmed this once. I filmed it like two weeks ago actually. It's the middle of September right now. I filmed this about two weeks ago and the quality was so bad. It was so pixelated. And like it had a lot of noise um, not actual noise but it's when a photo has like little specks or a video has a lot of little specks in it it's called noise uh, so yeah it had a lot of noise so anyway also a target this I bought in store those two I bought online so this one was by acceleration they have a whole bunch of bralettes and they're all like 12 dollars which isn't too bad this one's just a soft cotton one and it has the regular straps And then I also got in gray. They have like striping ones, but that's not my style. First, these aren't in order of what I bought them, but I have them by store. This one's from J. Crew. I got an extra small. And what sucks is I washed it. I didn't dry it because it's 100% cotton. Uh, but it's so starchy now. It's so soft when I bought it. So it's just, oh goodness. It's just this blue shirt. It's not like a navy blue. It's just like a... That navy blue is just like a dark blue and it has a little pocket and it's just a t-shirt it's just a t-shirt but um it was 950 and i really like the quality of j crew shirts and i like this because it was the same material as the olive green muscle tank i bought like a month or two ago and i thought i was gonna wash the same but this one is much starchier and i washed and dried it the same way like i wash them and then I hang them on a clothing rack to dry so they don't shrink because they're 100% cotton and it's already an extra small like I'm not usually extra small but this was an oversized shirt so I got an extra small. JCPenney's loves to send me $10 off coupons I don't know why I guess because they want me to come spend money in their store and I really don't like their clothes so the only time I go in there is when, I know it's horrible, but it's when I have the $10 off coupons and it's $10 off any $10 purchase. I actually just went yesterday and made the purchase again. Um, I bought these uh, exercise capris for $0.50 because they're $10.50. So, but this is what I bought for this haul for August. Um, I bought two of these tanks and it ended up costing me two dollars and fifty cents so i got this they're both in a medium they're by the brand chin up we sell this brand in my work as well um the thing is this thing is already pilled i wore them each maybe twice work it out it's got like a little floral print i got this to exercise in it's cute and i got this one by the brand freeze oh goodness that says swim with mermaids 
can see that. My animals love to make noise. My dog is walking around dangling. She almost knocked me over today trying to chase ducks. She literally rammed like this into me. And then my rabbit's drinking, so I have to wait to finish. Okay, on to February 21. I, this is like the color that I love. I don't know why. It was burgundy before, now I'm closer, getting closer to this like rusty color. And this was 11.50, I got it in a small. It's a little short, a little short, not too bad. It's got a little tie, like keyhole design. And it's like, it's three quarter sleeves. You have a little, what's it called, thing to do it up here. And it's like that, what's the material? Like cheesecloth, but not really. I don't know. It's called crepe. Um, I'm probably saying it wrong because it's French, but that's the type of material it is. So, and then also at Forever 21, after I bought that rust blouse, walked out the store. I put this one away. Walked out the store. I bought just the rust blouse. I decided it was a good idea to go back and get the burgundy crop top that was too big on me. Um, it fits. It's not that it doesn't fit, it's just the straps are a little long and they're not adjustable. So I gotta be careful um, where it's plate, where I like have it sitting. But I decided I have to have it. So I walked back in the store five minutes later, picked it up off the rack and bought it. So this one was $6 and it's in a medium. Like I said, I needed, I really needed a small. Where's the size? Oh, well, I cut out the size because I guess because it was itchy. So, but yeah, this one was a medium. It's got steam on the front. But like I said, it's a little big. It's not a big deal. It's still really cute. It looks good with like high-waisted jeans. I wore it with high-waisted dark wash jeans. It looks really cute. I think it would be really good for fall, especially in Florida because it's still 100 degrees. And I bought another crop top because I think it's a uh, good thing to buy in fall. Anyway, not, not that I... It's not that I can't wear them, it's that I don't really even wear crop tops, and why do I buy them? Why? But this one I got at Nordstrom, and it was $7.50. It's by BP. I got it in the medium, and these fit tight. But I wore this, and I actually remember this, and uh, like tight, like tight, um, high rise dark wash jeans to my friend's bachelorette party because I don't own anything sexy and like going out looking so I don't know I'm gonna think you're supposed to look sexy at a bachelorette party um I don't know I don't know how to look sexy it's more like here I am casual not trying so hard and I'm not single so it doesn't matter really um I'm not trying to sit there and pick up a guy while I'm at the party so anyway but I really like it. I don't know. I picked it up. I don't know if it was a good idea or not. At Target, I got this. What did I get at H&M? Oh, it's my phone. At Target, I got this shirt to replace one I bought from Mud that likes to gape at the buttons. And um, the one size up in it was too big. So I bought a small. And the buttons gape so much, I don't understand it. So I ended up uh, getting rid of that one. I'm getting this one. I mean, and purchasing this one. This one's from Target, though. It's in a small. It's by Morona. And this is was nine dollars. I like this material, also. It's much softer, and it lays better on my body. And you want things to lay properly when you want to look like good. And you don't. You have stuff you want to hide. You don't want it to be laying odd. You don't want it to make you look bigger than you are. And those are from. H&M as well and they were $13. I have the same ones in a olive color and they were both in a size 8. A size 8. Normally I wear a 2 or 4 or a size 5, 7 juniors and I had to get an 8 in H&M. So don't look at the size. The size means absolutely nothing. If it makes you feel better, cut out the size. <laughs> Just cut out the size. You know, The size doesn't mean anything. Freaking companies make up sizes. I'm telling you. There's not like a standard size. So really, because I just bought a bridesmaid dress and I'm a size 10. And the lady at the store says, wow, that's small. To me, size 10 is not small for my body. Size 10 is not small. But how the dresses are made in that dress, I'm a size 10. 
I have dresses in my closet that are size 2. I have clothes in my closet that are size 8. So, we're going to stop talking about that now. So, ignore my pasty legs. This is the shorts. Ignore my rolls. This is not the most flattering angle. Sorry about the extremely unflattering angle, but that's all I can do right now because I have to have my camera set up here because my lighting is behind it. So. Also, from H&M, I got this mint shirt. This was $4, and this is in a medium. It is big, but it is so comfy. And it looks cute. It's not as soft as it was when I first bought it because I washed it a few times. It's got a pocket. This thing is pretty big for me personally um but I like it it's cute okay and the two things I have left from Kohl's are this plaid shirt which I bought the one the same one but you guys already saw it it's like a pink and blue and white and I got this one in the blue and white and it's in a medium it's either brand Crofton Bar which is really an old lady brand and I was surprised they had this because this was really cute some of them returned it from online and it has like this slit in the back. It's really cute for like this brand that usually all the people in my that come into my work that are between 60 and 80 by and this is cute. It's soft, it's comfortable. I've washed it a few times. It's not starchy. I haven't put it in the dryer either. And usually things get starchy. But I gotta be careful because it's Rayon and Rayon likes the pill and look like shit. <laughs> Buzz. $4.50. This next one was $6 and this is wrinkly. I bought the same one in camo. You're going to see in my uh, September haul. But I got this in a small. It's by Rock and Republic. I love this color. I love blush. Anyone who knows me, I wear blush. I like blush. I like this color. Why? Because wash me out. I don't know why I would like it, but I like it. Like This isn't doing anything for me. But I like this color and I wear this as a like cardigan. Um, yeah. I wear it as an overshirt. I don't wear it like buttoned up. I mean, I guess I could, but I wouldn't wear it to work like that because I would like to wear leggings with it if I was. And it's a high-low. And I love Rock and Republic. The quality is amazing. Um, the clothes are very expensive, but I buy them on clearance. But I love their pants. I love their bottoms. Oh my god, they fit amazing. They wear amazing. My favorite bottoms are from Rock and Republic. But anyway, let me show you guys this stuff on. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this. Uh, if you have any recommendations for videos, leave them down below. I can do chit chat videos or anything. Um, you guys want me to talk about because if you guys are tired of the fashion stuff, let me know because I don't know. You guys don't really, I don't really get comments like that about what you want to see. It's just like uh, a few people like my videos and that's about it. So you guys have to let me know. So you guys just have to let me know. It'll be awesome. Then we, I can make videos that you guys are enjoying to watch. Because I don't want to make videos that you don't love to watch. Because then nobody's going to watch me. And what's the point of making the videos if nobody's watching them? Even though I like, I like making videos. But there's no point in watching. There's no point in me making them and spending the time editing and filming. And doing the blog and everything that I do. If you guys aren't interested in seeing it. Okay. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> done with the rant. See you guys later. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. And that's it. See you guys later.